This is the No Face Movements, June of 5th, 2017. Um, I've been looking at this, the same kind of articles. I mean, they keep on writing the same kind of articles because they can't explain this mysterious spot of phenomenon that's happening to this star called Bojens. Bojens uh, star. Um, and what's crazy is how the NBC News and all these mainstream media news, even government, NASA, been writing articles about this star for since last year, around November 2016. This article, and I want people to remember, read between the eyes, because the television, what is the television? You know what I'm saying? What is the television? What is the TV? What are these movies and TV shows and news and false media and all this BS out there? It's programming. All right. In the early 90s, we saw movies about tsunamis, major earthquakes, all the way up to 2012. With, you know what I'm saying? All these, for like the past 20 years, we've been watching a lot of movies on about major storms. And the reason we're watching these movies on major storms or comics or asteroid or tornado or the day after tomorrow or twister or <laughs> volcano uh, with tom jones in it and they're putting this in your mind all right because in the 90s the storms weren't that bad but as the millennium approach as 2012 was approaching and our planet was lining up with the central galactic plane all right what happens when we line up with the central galactic plane is where we're experienced from the Mayas to Incas to the Egyptians, the Babylonians to the Israelites to all of them throughout society, all living in different places, report every single 15 to 2,000 years that something major happened. And that was supposed to happen on December the 21st, 2012, and it did. But it's not the way the movie 2012 shows it. It happens within a 10 year to the year 2022, and I already made a video about that. All right, and just starting a few months ago, our plan actually aligned with the central galactic plane. We came around our sun, and our whole solar system is now spinning to, from the central galactic plane. So the central galactic plane is pulling us in. Before that, we were behind the sun. Yes, we've seen a lot of major disasters, but from 2017 to the year 2020 we will see the most devastating storms in our history we will see the most devastating x-class solar flare we're going to see the worst behavior of mankind because gravitation moons and all that stuff really do affect your body really do affect the earth from high rise sea that's why there's more mur murders when there's a full moon all right and we wind up with the central galactic plane now let's get into this article mysterious alien megastructure star is at it again all right, if it wasn't an alien megastructure, this is mainstream media. It should just said mysterious star is at it again. But for some reason, they had to catch your attention. Alien megastructure. Alien megastructure. Mysterious alien megastructure. All right, so as you read this article, it's going to talk about this star called Bojang. All right, and since last year, they just found the, uh, the star, but... The dimming of how bright it gets and how slim it gets and it keeps flashing back and forth, they cannot explain. Like planets, they think a planet might blow up around it and it's just circling, so it causes a dimming effect. They do not know what's happening. But if they do not know what's happening, why would they call it alien megastructure and keep worrying about the same thing? It might be an alien megastructure. i tell you this. They kept Planet X a secret for so long. They kept the planet Nibiru so long a secret. All right, but the truth is, there is a planet X that comes within our solar system, or you want to call it Nibiru, or Planet 10, or whatever you want to call it. When you look at the ancient people and their carvings from Babylonian to the Egyptians to the Mayans, they always show 10 planets. All right, and then they show later on a picture 11th planet. What happened to the 10th planet? Does anyone know? Does anyone know what happened to the 10th planet? It got destroyed. Do you know where the 10th planet is? It's called the asteroid belt. Right after Earth, there's the asteroid belt. That used to be a planet, and something major came and wiped it off and caused an asteroid belt. And somehow we ended up with the moon. 
There you go, folks. All right. But every single 2015 to 2000 years ancient societies report when our planet lines up with the solar, the central galactic plane. The central galactic plane is the whole universe, basically. And you got our galaxy, all that. But you got the central, the middle star that makes our sun circle of it, and we circle our planet. All right. And what's crazy about this is when we line up with it from 2012 till the end of February, beginning of March 2007, we're on the other side of the sun circling. Now the sun is moving too in a circular motion, motion just like our planets is. And this time, starting in February, March, all our planets to the year 2020 is between the central galactic plane and the sun. So, from the gravitational point from this view, imagine, it's pulling at our sun, so we're going to see more solar flares, more solar storms coming our way. That's why we're seeing more asteroids than ever coming near Earth, is because the central galactic plane is pulling it in, and we're right in the midst of it as we're circulating the sun and missing it. But something else is coming. Another planet is coming. All right, they call it Nibiru, Planet X, now the government official. They even had this on NBC and they and CNN before 2012 about how this mysterious planet was coming towards Earth and it might reach us between the year 2017 and 2025. And this is what they're talking about, folks. The links are going to be at the bottom. This is the No Face Movement. I want everyone out there to be prepared. It could be alien megastructure. It could be a blown planet. But if it was a blown up planet, the lights, the star want to flash on or off. What I think is a comet or an asteroid or, like I said, a planet. Nibiru, planet X, is coming towards Earth. So it's flashing. and So the star is in front of it while all the tail and the debris that's following it is coming towards us. So I want everyone out there to be prepared as our central galactic plane. Is in the midst of the heat to the year 2020. This is the movement, move, moving to next time, facing off.